Savannah State University. I'm Dominic Ross, and I'll be the host for this documentary retort known as The Trace. Here at Savannah State University, we do offer the program of Forensic Science Minor. Throughout this documentary, I have several interviews with students and professors like Dr. Marriott who are experienced in the field and can definitely get you more involved and interested. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, Trace, the rhetoric. My name is Dr. Carlison Marriott. Um, I'm an assistant professor of forensic science at Savannah State University. How long have you been involved in the forensic science field? Uh, I have been in the field of forensic science since 1996 um, when I first started working at the forensic lab um, at home in Jamaica. And why is it that you chose the field and what sparked your interest in forensic science? Well, um, my mother was the one that really started, um, well, she really um, stoked my interest in forensic science. Um, she was always reading these true detective magazines. Um, she would always be watching mystery shows on TV. Um, so whenever she wasn't around, I would um, read these magazines. There were true detective um, magazines and they were kind of graphic, but nonetheless I was intrigued because I can remember still um, that there was one particular murder um, that involved um, asphyxia um, using a garbage bag. And you could actually see the facial impression in the garbage bag and I can actually um, remember seeing that right now. And they actually helped um, um, catch the killer using that garbage bag with a facial impression. So um, I just took on an interest since then. Well, um, actually into my second year here at Savannah State University, I knew that I wanted to be a behavior analysis major. And I knew that I wanted to practice forensic psychology. So actually my second year, and then once I got in contact with Dr. Marriott, my interest expanded then. I think I developed an interest for forensic science maybe during my ninth grade year in high school. I was watching an episode of America's Most Wanted and they were using a lot of forensic te techniques. And so, you know, I started looking more into it. And then from there, I was kind of hooked. What are the benefits of being a forensic science major or minor here at Savannah State University? Well, it's not a major yet, but we're working on developing um, a forensic science major. But as a minor right now, it means that you can do um, a major in chemistry, a major in biology, a major in criminal justice, a major in behavioral analysis, and still do a minor in forensic science. What it does, it's, it's opening you up into um, other possibilities, career options. Um, it uh, makes you more marketable, I believe. Um, and also, uh, it makes you aware of your rights as a human being in society as well. Actuality, I wish that it would be a major, because I think, I feel that a lot of young African American students would benefit from such a field, to know that they can be the person that could help prevent crimes in the future, to know they could be the person or the persons that would help the authorities to capture criminals. And it might sound a little cheesy, but to know that they can be the person to actually make the world, and that includes the African-American world, a little bit better. Um, to be honest, I heard a lot of nice things about Dr. Marriott, and that she was skilled in what she knew and what she does. 
So I felt that by taking her, her courses that I would gain more knowledge in that field. How many students would you say are currently enrolled here in the Forensic Science Minor Program? Well, when I just started in 2006, now there was a minor before that, but we, um, it was a little, uh, well, the enrollment was low. So when I just started in 2006, um, not many students knew about it, and the enrollment was um, pretty low at that time. Um, but since then, I've tracked the enrollment, and we have like increased enrollment in our classes um, at least. Uh, um, ninefold in some classes, six to ninefold. Um, so we have had um, an increase in enrollment, which is very positive, and a lot of um, more students are interested. Plus, we have um, community interest as well. Um, uh, so I, I actually host um, forensic science workshop for um, middle school, um, high school students, and they come and they're sent um, through the Learning for Life program. Um, so there's a lot of interest in that area. Do you believe that there are any negative sides to the forensic science field? Well, there is not a negative side to the forensic science field. Um, it's just in the application of forensic science by individuals that uh, don't apply the science properly or principles properly, scientific princi principles properly. So that can be a negative in that um, one of the key things that I talk to my students about is that forensic science isn't all about um, putting away the bad guy or locking somebody up that you think is guilty. It's about actually um, using science um, to ensure that um, justice is served, that you actually find um, the individual who is responsible for a particular crime. Um, so I'm very concerned about the fact that there are a lot of innocent people that are locked up in jail or in prison or possibly have been executed and they're innocent. You know, so that bothers me um, when people are gung-ho and don't allow the evidence to speak for itself without bringing in their own individual bias or not actually properly applying or understanding the scientific principles or the scientific instruments that they use to analyze these evidence, um, evidential material. With good instructors like uh, Samaria, a lot of students, we give her a hard time, but a lot of us thirst for knowledge. And um, it's my belief, sincerely, from my heart, uh, at my advanced age, I'm a lot older than most of the students here. And I've seen a lot of things all over the world. And I just believe that with the forensic science minor, hopefully one day a major, this would open up the avenue of approach for students that usually don't have these kind of uh, instructions and instructors. It's almost uh, imperative that we have some type of uh, forensic science minor or program at an HBCU because a majority of African American students fresh out of high school, this is where they come to learn. And it is here at these institutions where they receive their proper guidance. And it's best to have the proper guidance from teachers like Dr. Marriott and other teachers that are willing to go out on a limb to assist us and to guide us. program in Savannah State is awesome. With um, Dr. Marriott being the instructor, instructor um, you will leave with more knowledge than you ever thought that you could gain about forensic science. I feel that the forensic science program here in Savannah State has shown me a new light to what I thought I knew and what I could learn. And Dr. Marriott, she has just made this experience so wonderful like for me. I feel like as an African-American female or woman, I can go to the job more confident knowing that I can do things that I never thought I could do. I think the forensic science program in Savannah State is a great program. Um, Dr. Marriott, she is a very good professor. She has opened my eyes to a whole lot of things. She has told me to think outside the box. Don't just think in the box, think outside the box. And she helps make the model here at Savannah State. You can get anywhere from here 
more attainable and, and makes it more, I can see it in my life. The science program here at Savannah State is great because we have a great, um, we have a great professor, Dr. Marriott, who teaches us book sense, but also she gives us hands-on opportunities as well with the labs. And with that, you know, once you get, once you leave these doors at Savannah State, you will be able to say, I know what I'm doing and I do it right. I would have to say I love the forensic science program here at Savannah State University with leading professors at Dr. Marriott. Um, this program just kind of encourages me, gets me through my Thursdays. I love the class and <laughs> I just really enjoy it. Well, um, I think that uh, students that are really interested in forensic science or interested in science in general would love to do forensic science because it's a way of um, presenting science or the scientific principle with real life application. If you're interested in science, if you're interested in law enforcement, if you're interested in um, making yourself more marketable out there, um, these days it's you have to be competitive in the job market and there will be more jobs available for forensic scientists. Um, the Department of Labor predicts that um, jobs for forensic scientists will actually increase um, up until the year 2016 um, by some 30 something percent. So it is an up and coming field. I would recommend it to students that even have a glimmer of an interest that to explore it further. Thank you very much. Thank you.